since it's hot to, it's 28 degrees today no it is not it is 28 degrees celsius, celsius. there's some transition here at this little skate park we've come to because dan wanted to come here so uh, <laughs> you're not having a good time here oh no I, i'm really keen to try some stuff on the water club which Haley is skating right now you never see me skate transition rarely so there's a few tricks i want to get it's like front side 5.0 like a nice controlled one. Oh, on top no yeah. slash no nah, like on there and then going back in front smith which is going to be weird and then uh front lip slide and a front air see how these tricks are front and maybe a back back lip back lip slide depending how i feel you got back lip slide you've learned that one before yeah but it, I, don't, I haven't exercised it enough so i'm not really i bet i could get you to do there. a back tail maybe on the baby quarter all right let's get it what are we starting with You gotta get on the deck. Was I on the deck? I mean, it was, but your like body weight wasn't sitting on it like a ledge. Like, get on top, grind, and like control that thing. Woo! Yeah, you're too in ramp. To sit on a front 5.0, you want to be kind of on top of it. Like, be as on top of it as you can, like a ledge. Really? Yeah. I thought it was yeah, so you just stand there, and then you can hold it, and you can just come out however you want. Are you sure? Yeah, it's the only trick I do. Oh, God. Yeah, just get up on it like a ledge, trust me. Oh! That was better. But it wasn't... It was It was the right... You were. Your body weight was right, it just wasn't super 5.0 weight. What was a 5.0? There you go. I keep letting you. Yeah, just drag your tail. That's better. There it is. Oh, That's how you sit on it. Oregon. They're easy. It is what it is. Now, see, now you need to like sit on one. Like you're getting on it right, you're grinding it, and then you're just kind of like coming back in. Try to really like, like grind one. Sit on it until it stops. Yeah, grind until it stops. To Stay on the ramp. Oh, that was better. Yeah, you can like drag your foot a little bit too. Really? Yeah. Yep. I want to like stop and then do it. Just keep all your weight on the one top. Oh, yeah. Toe side. There you go. Are your wheels supposed to go like that, Matt? Yeah, but you don't want to go to tail stall like a chump. Okay. Uh, okay, well, I mean, it looks like you're cozy enough on it that I think you should try the corner. Ooh. How do you do a corner? Same thing. You just get up on it and you just, you literally just sit there. Like, the corner's not going to add that much to it besides fear. I'll give it a crack. Yeah, you got it. Just get up on top. I would get on like maybe like six, like a foot before the crack. That way you can like sit on it, get adjusted, and then go into it. That's close. Get it more on top though. Get in there. There you go. <laughs> Yeah. Try to grind the whole thing. You. Yeah, that's it. Go even faster. He just learns everything so fast. I just tell him small tidbits and he just does it. That was it. And you've never been able to do those? No. Well, I always, I always, bait, like I always get in heel, but I'm like over here. Oh yeah. I'm not on like this. 
feels nice, doesn't it? It feels great. It's, it's way better. It's like one of the best feeling tricks. It's you know front five O stall and the little tail smack is my favorite skateboard trick. Actually, it recently got replaced with back fifty fifty. But how do you do the? You just ollie out. What? You just ollie out like you would a five O grind on a ledge. But how do you hit it? Oh, you just same way you ha tail smack into a bank. You just got to aim it. Oh. Let's try a front smooth. Okay, same lock in the same way to dip it. Really? Yep. Yeah, don't try to slash it, otherwise you'll be leaning in the wrong way. Right. First try. How do you grind it, grind it, bud? It grind it? I heard it. It was a, like... Well, I mean, you're just learning. This is baby's first steps, not first cartwheel. You just did that so good. You gotta go up and over. Up and over. Yeah, get so on you top. you have to like let your wheels go and then... So I always used to do this. Yeah, it's like a late dip. Yeah. That's why standing up on front five O's is crucial to understand before you learn front smiths. That just unlocked another trick. Yeah, oh absolutely. Front five O's stand up unlocks front smith. Yep. Instead of trying to just do a slash smith because I could never understand it. Um, all right, let's try a front lip. Okay. It'll come pretty quick, and then we'll try a front air. Okay. Before I do this trick, though, I did, like, three of them earlier. So it's not like I'm learning it on the spot. But, um, I'm trying to get, like, a nice, lengthy front lip on the quarter here. Well, you learned the other two on the spot. Yeah. I think front smith is definitely debatably a lot harder than front lip. You reckon? Kind of. I suck at front lips. I like, it feels more comfy than a back lip for me. I'm more of a front side guy. Yeah, back lips work better for me on transition. Yeah, you're also kind of like, like, give it a little nollie in, you know what I mean? What am I doing? Try to deck it out more. Try to get more on top, like a ledge. You reckon? Yes. It looks cooler. I'll what you're doing looks sloppy. Uh, ollie in. Sure. Or nollie. You don't have to ollie. You can just spin into it, but get more on t on the deck. What did I do then? Just It was just soggy. Ah, uh, soggy stuff. Ah, she's getting revenge. Okay. Yeah, that looks way better. Also, you did that first try. Oh. Yeah. What you mean. Yeah, when you hear those wheels squeak, it just looks and sounds so much better. Yeah, you want to be like that. I was like here, huh? Yeah, even more so in range. Like yeah, you're like there. So you're be like that. Yeah, you want to be like that. As decked out as you possibly can, it just looks better. It doesn't make it easier, I would say. It definitely makes it more controlled, though. There's no real ollie either. It's kind of just like a delicate... Yeah, it's like a scoop. Yeah. That was a good one. Yeah, you got this all day. Oh! Front side ollies? Yeah. Uh, yeah, snap as close to the coping as possible. Otherwise, you'll end up going towards the coping. You want to ollie at coping. Like, you go up to coping and ollie, and it'll pull you this way. If you ollie too low, you're going to go at it. Yeah. Oh, fuck. That was it. But I landed in the fucking water. <laughs> yeah, but you went above the coping. Really? Yeah, that was first try. Let me try it. I don't want to. Okay. Get it. Yeah, that's good. Kind of gotta like loop out of it almost. You're not gonna get a video out of this. You're doing everything too but fast. But snap your tail, no, because we're, we're breaking it down for the average Joe to understand. Even with the going. breaking down, you just do it first shot. No, but this is how you do it. Allow your front wheels to like just barely touch coping like this, and then give it a snap. Because what happened with me was I would here and I'd just go and get scared. Yeah. But if you snap it at the right spot, your weight's going to be in transition. Yeah. And it's just, it's not even much of a turn. It's more of an ollie. Yeah, it's absolutely a carving ollie more so than a yeah, front Yeah, if you try and huck it, you'll probably over-rotate. So here's what you should try next. You should try to do a decent-sized frontside ollie, but land in disaster. Oh, onto the coping? Yeah, All like right. ollie disaster. Okay. Oh, yeah, you got that. <laughs> Woo! Is that it? Yeah, that was good. I felt a bit. So now you gotta smack it fast. What do you mean? The second you're in disaster, come in. 
Like the millisecond your disaster touches, you you nolly in. What? Yeah, it just looks really cool. So just faster. Quick. Yeah, the second you touch. That was good. You got to be a little delicate though, because that's a board breaker. Is it? Yeah, that trick will break your board if you do it too hard. I mean, you're doing it. That was good. You ready for your next trick? What? Back feeble to fakie. What? Yeah, feeble to fakie. Yes. You don't have to grind it. How just you, stall it. Oh, how do you stall it? It's, you, it's just a rock to fakie. No. You, yes, it is. It is. It is just a rock to fakie. People overthink them. When I learned them, the way it was explained to me was, it's just a rock to fakie. Sounds like you were explaining to you. I don't know that much about stuff. Okay, well, let me let me explain then. All right, so if you can deck out rock to fakie, which means you're all the way to the end push, that's the same length of a fakie manual as you have from here. So this and this, the difference is very slight. The second you start lifting up, you just got to hold it for a second. It's like a very easy trick to get away from. Lift it up a little longer. It's not a fast to fakie, it's flowy. See how you're lifting up real fast to get out of it? Don't do that. You just have to manual for like half a second. Got it? Not really. Okay, just try feeble fakie. Okay, it's the same thing. You're good. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> Don't lie to him. No. Yep. Oh, that's scary. So all your body weight stays in ramp. All oh, of it. You just... Exactly. Yeah. All of your body weight in, and you lock in heel side. Okay. I don't know if I've ever seen Haley do a feeble fakie. Oh, I... like... I don't see you doing them. Well, I don't like doing them because I don't like feebles. Two on top. Yeah, yeah. You got to be like, you can go really slow at them. Just like that. Just be barely in it. Just get that wheel just barely over it. How do you pull the wheel out? You just lift up and it just goes in. Second you fake your mani, you get out of it. Mm, too much on top. Less on top. So it's a place. You just yeah, place it. yeah, you're very much in ramp. Oh, you could have done that one. How come I didn't get out? Because you jumped off. No, but my wheel. Are you supposed to feel that? Yeah, it comes out, and then you take your mani in. Yeah, it's it's, it's more tricky. fluid. No, you got it. You got it. Just stay on it. That's fucking scary. No, just commit to one. That was it. You could have done it. Keep all your body weight in the ramp and then just fake you mani for a second. You got it. Just think if you're leaning this way with all your body weight, you can't slip out. This is scarier than the front end. Oh! She just shut me up on the mini. No, she didn't. She literally just set skateboarding back like 12 years. <laughs> you could have done it and you jumped off. Yeah. It's scary. Just stay on it. It's a rock to fake you, damn it. Do you want me to hold your hand? I'll do it. Yeah, let's try that theory. Okay. No, it's, no, it'll it's not a theory. Yeah, it'll yeah. definitely work. So. so you just stand over on the bottom of the ramp. You come over here. Have your hand out, but don't. My hand's on one. Which hand do you want me to grab? Obsessed with it. Now maybe you could do one on your own. Can you stand there though? <laughs> <laughs> you know when the kids wanted to drop in. Yeah. <laughs> you, Can you just stand there. Just spot him, okay? I'll, I'll, even, I'll even look really ready. Because he will be ready to catch you. Don't worry, he'll catch you. Oh, <laughs> oh yeah, you haven't done it yet. 
Yeah, then you gotta do it when I'm over oh, here. Oh, you gotta do it when I'm way over here. Oh, that's gonna be tough. Watch him fail. <laughs> Watch him fail. Come on, you just uh, did it. You just did two in a row. Uh-huh. Alrighty, you now it's over. Do it on the bigger one. Why? What do you mean? Do do another one on the taller side of the baby one. Yeah. So I learned this back lip like a few weeks ago at Lincoln Park. Is it Lincoln, that little one in Long Beach with a coin? Probably because it's the penny with Abraham yeah. Lincoln on it. <laughs> yeah, that's the park. Um, but I haven't done it since then, so I feel like this transition is a bit bigger. I'm just going to give it a few goes. All right, first try. First try to warm up. Oh, oh, slippery. Now, now put your foot on the nose and now the end. You don't want to just like uh, in. Meh, you in? truck in. Is you that truck in. Scientific Hit the term. Yeah, Google it. Oh wow. Hey. Whoa. Oh. Yeah? Look at look at him looking at you he for approval. Back. He, looked back. he was like, I got my foot near the nose. <laughs> It is. <laughs> I'm completely knackered after that. It's like 28 degrees. It's probably like 30 degrees Celsius out here. Super hot. We're going to Panera Bread after this. That's what I'm hanging for. The fruits of our labor. Also, if you guys are unaware, I've made a second channel. It's for content outside of skateboarding, just like regular life stuff I get up to. So it's kind of like all the behind the scenes stuff that I do outside of skateboarding. If you want to check it out, the link is in the bio. Make sure you subscribe and uh, yeah. There's a way more extra content coming your guys' way. So make sure you go over to the second channel and subscribe. I actually sized down a bit too much in the one stars. I should have got a nine and a half. I got a nine and I've got a bit of a, a burst leak. In my pinky toe. That sucks. Oh well, I'm sure these will break in in no time. One quick word before the end of the video, guys. Appreciate all you guys' support. Always leaving lovely comments for me to respond to. I try to respond to everyone but sometimes the videos are so, they're not that close together, but I feel like they're back to back and sometimes I lose track of which videos I have to respond to comments on. But a really cool way you can support me over here on this channel is there's a thing in the comment section called Super Thanks and it's basically like a tip. You can tip me for the video or whatever if you like. Um, that's pretty cool and your comment will be like highlighted and I respond as quickly as possible. And yeah. Also, check out eveningmob.com. Check out my second YouTube channel. The link is in the description below. And uh, yeah, learned a bunch of tricks today. As usual, more skating to come. Thank you for your guys' support. Trying to pronunciate English better. Losing my damn accent out here and I'm not happy about it. But yeah, catch you guys in the next video. On your way back, bring me his son. On, 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 on your way back, bring me his son. On your way back, bring me his son On your way back